While Leo continues to rake in the moolah at the box office, actor Vijay has dived right into his next project directed by Venkat Prabhu. Predictably, Vijay's 68th is creating quite a buzz. Meanwhile, there's curiosity around the progress of Ajit Kumar's next film, Vidamuyarchi, and Vetri Maran's Vidudalai 2. Get the lowdown on the latest happenings in the Tamil film industry with updates from the Federal. Sources in the Tamil film industry say that Vijay's next film, a Venkat Prabhu directorial, is a sci-fi movie, a genre which the popular actor has never explored, though he has starred in over 67 films so far. Sources also reveal that during a recent visit to Los Angeles, both Vijay and Venkat Prabhu underwent 3D scanning for the project. Excitingly, there's industry speculation that Vijay will be taking on a dual role in this much-anticipated film. Action King Ajit Kumar is all set to entertain his fans yet again with some intense and gripping action sequences in his upcoming highly anticipated film Vida Muyarshi. Currently, the film crew is shooting high-octane bike and car chase scenes in Azerbaijan, says Sources. The scenes are being shot by talented lensman Nirav Shah using advanced camera equipment. Helmed by writer-director Magil Tirumeni and produced by Laika Productions, the action drama stars Trisha Krishnan as the female lead. Vetrimaran is currently busy shooting the second part of his much-acclaimed film Vidudalai featuring Suri and Vijay Sedhupadi. Originally set for a January 2024 release, the film has now been pushed to May as the shooting has not been wrapped up. This delay has affected Vetrimaran's ambitious project Vadi Vasal starring Surya, which will now hit the flows only in 2024 end. In the interim, Surya will get on board the film project to be helmed by his Surare portrait director Sudha Kongara. The shooting for that film will kick off early next year. Vikram, a stellar actor in Indian cinema, sees Tangalan as a potential winner, confident in his hard-hitting narrative penned by no less than the powerhouse writer come director Paranjit. The team anticipates success both at the box office and film festivals, marking a turning point in Vikram's flagging career. Set in the Kolar gold fields, Tangalan will showcase his acting prowess. The Federal reveals that footage from Rajnikan's Lal Salam, directed by Aishwarya Rajnikan, has gone missing. Despite concerns that the film will not make it for the scheduled Pongal 2024 release, the team remains hopeful about recovering the lost footage and sticking to the original plan. Kamal Hassan, in a recent interaction with fans and party members, announced the arrival of Indian 3 alongside Indian 2 in 2024. Director Shankar, impressed with the footage shot for Indian 2, has requested an additional 30 to 40 days for the third installment, a proposal Hassan could hardly refuse and, in fact, readily approved after viewing the rushes. Sources within Satya Jyoti Films reveal that Captain Miller is poised to be Danish's most high-budget film to date. Helmed by Arun Mateshwaran, known for Rocky and Sani Kaidam, the period thriller features Kannada actor Shivaraj Kumar and Danush's elder brother. With a total estimated cost of 100 crore rupees, this marks the highest investment ever made by a production house for a Danish starer. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.